Mr. Peter Obi, the Labour Party LP nominee for president, has outlined why, if elected in 2023, he will not prioritize investigating the previous administration. After formally introducing Dr. Yusuf Dati Baba Ahmed as his running mate for the 2023 elections, he made this statement on Friday in Abuja while responding to questions. He claims that his purpose is to avoid distractions and put an end to corruption. You hear me say that you can't close your shop and go pursuing criminals, so let me tell you about the investigation into the previous administration. Those who solely focus on today and yesterday will overlook future. God didn't give us eyes to look behind us. Mine are to look ahead. You will receive more if you enter government now and choose to halt the leakage first. No persecution or which halt will be, con will be conducted against me. It won't happen. Nigerians must maintain law and order according to B. Many people, he continued, believed that corruption was an insurmountable problem. However, I can assure you that if you, the ind main individual, the local government chairman, the governor or the president are not stealing, neither is your family nor anyone else, you will reduce by 70%. And I challenge everyone to present me with any former contractor, civil worker or supplier who claims that during the eight years I served as governor of Anambra State, I sat down with him and told him to add one naira to this. I'm quitting, I'm not going to do this anymore, if it is true. We were able to save roughly 70 billion naira because of this. See what my previous head of service said. Please, when I started paying the public officials their dues and leave allowances after they started disputing with me. They started asking me where I got the money, so he penned an article titled Stinginess as a Development Strategy. The public benefit should be served by using public funds. The public benefit should be served by using public funds. Okay? Alright, my VR Sato, what's your ration to this? Uh, please uh, drop your ration in the comment section. And your voice will be heard and clear around the world. And ensure you subscribe to our channel for more updates. Please uh, ensure you share the report across all Peter OB, APC, PDP, political platforms worldwide on Facebook, Instagram, Telegram, WhatsApp, and name it. And ensure you subscribe to our channel, okay? And that is it. Uh, Peter OB uh, discloses why he won't uh, probe Barry. Others, if elected president, and according to the president, is not going to make that a priority when elected. Then, uh, also, too, he did say that uh, when he was governor of Anambra State, uh, he never told anybody, any government officials, to add uh, to the expedition of a project. Uh, that, uh, uh, according to him, the public uh, benefit should be served by using public funds and also too uh he did say that uh, at a time some persons are now saying that uh, or uh, they made some articles saying that uh, stinginess as a development strategy and uh, that was made uh, you know a title of an article and uh, uh, that was done in order to make jest of him for the fact that uh, he's for development and not for sharing of uh, Anabra uh, state money. And uh, for this, uh, they did, uh, they were able to uh, save roughly 70 billion naira. And uh, 
that was when he was governor of Anambra State. All right, uh, please uh, like we said, enjoy subscribe to our channel and spread the report across all news platforms. Uh, known to UK, uh, let's see if we can take some rations from the comment section now. Uh, this is from plus two three four eight zero eight zero three two, which says, uh, okay, which says, I did say this before as if I knew. Peter is not that kind of man. Probe this, probe that is not him. He believes in how can money be made so that he will deliver his promises. He already knows the state of things that Nigeria is bankrupt and as it were, he is coming prepared to tackle it and he will make it work. He is the man for the job. Okay? According to this person, all right. Has some replies, and this is from uh, Lassisi Oyegade replying, saying, uh, but, he, but he failed to deliver his promises in our number. During his tenure, the ASU in the state owned university were on strike for overseas good months, and this same thing. And the same thing, doctors in government hospitals there, is that the promises you are talking about? Throughout his tenure, he failed to conduct an election for all the local government councils in the state, thereby making the all the towns and communities not to have an access dividend of democracy no social amenities and good infrastructures is that part of his promises a failure will always value a dollar a failure will always value a dollar okay that is it a failure will always value a dollar all right according to lassisi oyegade then uh add to joy the reply to lassisi saying uh, does state government control as who or fed government? No wonder some of you are easily deceived. All right, to God be the glory. Also commented saying, uh, "And who are you to justify his actions without a proper investigation? If you don't want him, vote for who you want. Are we not still in the mess of the change and next level?" You voted because of your decisions. Problem has been like bicycle to Nigerians, but this time most Nigeria youth will take the right step without your support. Okay, at least uh, to God be the glory. Replying to Lassisi there, Ohams also the reply to Lassisi saying, uh, "Who is your best past governor in Nigeria?" For now, who is your best past governor in Nigeria? For now, okay. All right. Ohams again to Lassisi uh, saying, uh, "Your problems is tribalism, ignorance, selfishness, corrupt. Okay, corruption. Okay. All right. See having more rations, and this is from guest saying, uh, replying to Lassisi as well as well, saying." Uh, Please, if I start pending lies against Tinibu or Atiku just because I'm not supporting them, does it make me a good man? Why can't we support our preferred candidates without spreading lies against others? I'm from Aqua, not Anambra, and I can tell you that everything you said here about Peter B are all lies, okay? Uh, Soch Ma, the reply to last is saying, uh, you are confused with fake history. You are confused with fake uh, history, okay? And uh, Nathan's Raymond also, okay, this is all we can take for now. Thanks and God bless and enjoy, subscribe to our channel and bye for now, okay?